Mm. More or less, yeah. Mm. <clears throat> Alright, so you guys already hear us talking, so let's go ahead and get on with this. What's up, guys? Shadow Weavers, partially censored game here. Back again with some Resident Evil Zero. I'm your host today, Shadow Necro 666. Joining me, of course, are the two cohorts of non related horror games. Chaos Order 13. And Chaos Envoy. You always go first. Shut the fuck up. <clears throat> so, we're diving back into Zero. Resident Evil Zero here. Today's goal is to reach the mansion. So, let's see how this goes. Yes. I have not touched this since the last time I played, and Let's... I should really get on to fucking playing more of this, but, eh. <laughs> I mean, we never claimed this was supposed to be a blind stream. Hurt. Well, it couldn't be a blind stream anyways, because I have beaten these games before. It's just been a long-ass time. Per, 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 let me put it this way. Personally, 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 I would rather they be done as fast as you possibly could. So you playing them regularly would be very welcome. <laughs> How much time do we have before the new Doom? What do you mean? They haven't or, announced. What were we? They haven't announced the next. We were part waiting of the on DLC. something. We were waiting on shit. What the fuck do you think? What were we waiting on? I think it might have been something I had planned that I didn't tell you guys about. I don't know. Probably was. I have I'm my confused. own secrets. Damn it. I'm, <clears throat> yeah, because I'm legit just confused at the moment. Oh, hi, dude, sir. <sighs> trying to remember what I was doing. You know, that is a fantastic question. You know what else is a fantastic question? Why you guys don't play horror games that much? I mean, let me let me put it this way. I I kind after after playing through Amnesia on PC years ago and playing more custom stories for it than I really care to remember. I kind of don't want to do that shit anymore. Mainly due to the fact that I'd rather not lose another few months worth of goddamn sleep <laughs> due to my own crippling fucking paranoia. Amnesia must have seriously fucked you up. You... Okay. Like... I've, I played some Resident Evil games before I, I played Amnesia. They were fine. I played some of the shit before Resident before that. It was fine. But once you genuinely play Amnesia, it is the most fucked shit possible because it's not... The game itself isn't scary. The game itself is actually fucking laughably entertaining. It's, it's because of how you're meant to play it that fucks you over because you have to play in a dark room with headphones on, so you immediately get tunnel vision, first of all. Second of all, the headphones make it so you genuinely start to think you're hearing things because of how much the ambient sound in that game is designed to genuinely fuck with your head. Like I So far, all I'm hearing is general good horror game. Oh, it's a it is it's a good horror game, yeah, but only when you play it like that. If you don't play it like that, it's pretty much just laughable as a horror game. Let me put it this way: after I actually finished playing it, I shit you not, any time I heard any kind of a sound in my house, I was literally twitching because I was genuinely thinking it was something like fucking happening. 
Like, you know how whenever you're in your house and you hear, like, random things like the, like the heater or the boiler or the AC going or just random, like, creaks of wood and shit? Occasionally, yes. Yeah, I started jumping from all that. Well, you gotta remember, I have acute paranoia as it is. Yeah, so do I. Then again, so, it's also because I don't I always them. have that shit going on. Yeah, that's always a big part of it. Well, that and I just generally don't like people. Save for a few exceptions. It's preaching to the choir, brother. You know, God, you think it's empty. Yuki, I feel like me and a bridge Kirito would get along fantastically. You say that, and I'm pretty sure he'd kick, he'd run your shit just for fun. Yeah, and you know the funny part? I'd be running his. Well, here's something y'all need to do. Go ahead and send me a link to what you're talking about. <laughs> Yuki, you're the resident fucking link guy. You have the link to that. I don't. I'll have to get the first episode link in a bit. Wait, you, Shadow, have you watched Sword Art Online? Yeah. Okay, good. Then that means that the context won't be lost then. Oh, son of a... Okay, Cloaker, Sniper in Space? What? <laughs> I mean, is it just me, Euclid, or do I find the noise that the cloakers make when they go to melee you just really strange? In case you guys are wondering, they're talking about Payday 2. Yeah. More or less. Oh, also, uh, fun fact, I bought, uh, ankle slash wrist weights today. Nice. How much? Oh, uh, only like 2.5 pounds. Ah, uh, come on. There's a reason. There's a fucking reason. What is the reason? I own a VR. What the fuck do you think the reason was? Yeah, but it's only how small they are. What was the reason for that? Uh, because playing Beat Saber without them is already hard enough on high difficulty. Mm hmm Especially if I go for like an hour or two. These are basically just to help me like start acclimating so that I can get faster and faster. Wait, did you say you bought VR trackers? No! No. Oh, thank god. I bought ankle slash wrist weights. Oh. Look at Goku. I told you this like hours ago! And they're actually decent training. However, the weight's too small, man. Um, you I'm should go sorry. At least four pounds. I'm trying to acclimate and build up, not break my wrists instantly. You know, I kind of need them to gain. break your wrist or ankles with just four pounds on each? Come on. <laughs> um, there's only two of them, and I'm not wearing them on my ankles when I use the VR. I'm wearing them on my wrists when I use the VR. My ankles don't mean shit for Beat Saber. What the fuck were you on? Why would I need my ankles You were to get saying faster? ankle wrists. There are ankle just regular slash wrist weights. Wrist weights. Ank any any weight that can be applied to your ankle can also be used for your wrist. These are, were literally advertised on the box as ankle and wrist weights. Mm. Well, just say wrist weights if you're only using them for your wrist. I'm only using them for my wrists when I'm playing Beat Saber. I don't know what else I'm using them for yet. I might I might try playing my boxing game with them on though. That'd be kind of neat. That would be good, and it would be decent practice for a. Uh... It would be decent. Not practice, it but would be exercise. Decent. Having training with fucking ro with fucking Rocky. If you're only gonna go for a, what is it, two point five? You said. That's what these ones are. 
So it's just a five pound bonus on weight, but you're only really doing two and a half. Yeah. You have to remember, an Oculus controller weighs next to nothing. Yeah. What I would do is get another one. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing now. That item isn't there. <clears throat> I would get another weight and put it on your uh, weaker arm. Uh, You're non-dominant. I'll consider that. Yeah. Right you just have a little extra weight on your non-dominant hand until you get about an equal strength rating in both of them. I'm at the moment currently just more concerned with just acclimating to get my arms to go faster. Maybe build up some strength, but yeah, it's, it's kind of more of a secondary goal. There it is. I left it in here. Ink ribbon. Okay, one of you. One button. Good. You know what's weird too is that technically wearing these while I play games on Xbox can is also in, in, is also good. Good idea too. Wearing them anytime control. works. Mm-hmm. Meow. Motherfucker, I hate this damn camera. Well, tough shit. That's a resi camera for you. Back in the day, I could do this flawlessly, no issues. Back in the day, back in the day, it's what I was a lot to. younger, and this shit was new. Yeah, but I was used to the gaming controls and how the camera sways and shit. It was normal for Wait, me. Wait, the camera sways? I thought it was stationary. The fuck have I been doing? It's stationary until you go around a corner. <laughs> yeah, but it doesn't sway, it just snaps. Yeah. There are moments where it does sway too. I mean, if you watch... Well, if you watch the stream, you can see it sometimes as I'm going through shit. Yeah. Like, I'm standing still now, so it has a minute to show it to you. I mean, I'm just trying to keep myself entertained. Since I'm on the train still, there is that sway from the train moving, basically. Oh my god! You gave this <laughs> madman the controls! Well, that's the problem. I'm not in control. I wasn't talking about you! Son of a bitch. No, I forgot to do something earlier.
Oh, so you guys want to hear what, hear something fucking great that's been happening to me for the past couple days? Hmm. So, I just got insurance through work. I just recently got that set up, right? Mm-hmm. I'm a prescription. Took it in on Friday last week to uh, uh, the pharmacy at work in order to get it filled out, right? Mm -hmm. It's like, okay, mm -hmm. it'll be ready. I'll pick it up tomorrow when I come into work. Okay, that's great. Whatever. Um, and then, uh, mm -hmm. what was it? Hold on a second. I'm trying to fucking think. <laughs> This is not working! Ah! Yes, yes, very nice. Um, um so, uh, like, okay, so I go out of work on Saturday, went over to the pharmacy. Not filled out yet. Apparently, they, the insurance company needs prior authorization from my doctor's office for the agree to cover the prescription. I'm like, okay, great, that's fine. So, I'm like, okay, whatever. Well, they're not. My doctor's office doesn't even open on the, on the weekend, so I'm like, fuck. So Monday rolls around finally. I'm on my last two pills for medication. I take two a day, so I'm on my last dose. Going on Monday, after I've talked to my doctor's office that morning before I went to work, and they told me informed me that they've already sent in sent over the paperwork and the notification or whatever for them to you know approve it or whatever. Get there, check in. No, still hasn't been fucking authorized yet. I'm like, oh fuck. So I called the insurance company, find out that they did receive the the information, but as a standard request, it takes Follow me. an estimated yeah. five to seven days. I just taken my last dose of medica my medication that morning. I'm fucked. So I texted mm. my mom. So I, te I, te I text my mom and I tell her. I tell explain everything to her and I told her because they the people in the insurance company informed me that if I call back the doctor's office and have them resubmit the request as a urgent case. Then it will be. Then it, they can process it within 24 hours to 48 hours. I'm like, okay, that's fine. That works. Great. Did have my mom do that by about lunchtime at five o'clock when my doctor's office closes. They still hadn't called my mom back. So I'm basically sitting here, you know, wondering, well, fuck me in the ass. So. My mom tells me just use my Medicaid card because I'm still technically on Medicaid. See if that'll work. That worked. They covered it. Went through. Got my medication. Great. Then, then, today, uh, today well, not today anymore. Yesterday, technically. Tuesday. Uh, we get a call from my doc. I get a call from my doctor's office in the morning. Get this. Not only now is... For, this is weird. I've had I've had my parents' insurance, my Medicaid insurance, my insurance from McDonald's when I worked there, and now this one. This is the first time this has happened. The insurance company said has requested that my doctor give them a clinical chart, basically explaining why I need this medication, and apparently, depending on that. They may require me to go see a mental health specialist before they'll appro they'll approve covering my fucking medication. A medication I've been taking for 20 plus years now. For a medical issue, not a mental health issue. Hmm. I legitimately have like have been like, like over the past over the past two days I've almost had an aneurysm because of the stupid fucking insurance company. Yeah, yeah that, that sounds about right for where we work. Yeah, okay. It it it's fan fucking fantastic. So there my doctor's off my doctor is apparently, you know, doing that stuff right now and the office is doing that, so that's getting handled right now. So we'll find out what the fuck is going on with that bullshit. And then 
mental fucking health specialist. The fuck am I gonna do when I, if I if I have to go to a mental health specialist? It's not like I have anything to talk about. Anything I do talk about is likely gonna make the person actually fucking com consider suicide. Not that we condone that. There we go. I was waiting for that. <laughs> I've, 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 had, I've had a couple of shots of rum, okay? My brain needed a minute. I was gonna let shit ride, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> we know you don't give a fuck. <sighs> and don't mind me, I'm just in the background turning Fallout 4 into a horror game again for the fifth time. Wait, you're playing Fallout now? Yeah, I redownloaded a whole bunch of games. I see, I see, I see. Yeah, I've gotten to that point too. I know how you feel. <laughs> I see, I see, says the blind man, whom his deaf wife, who is talking on the phone with a dog. Have you never heard that one before, Euclid? No, it's, it's like the fucking this Mr. Ed thing all over again. Wait, have you seriously never heard this? No, I've never heard that one. I see, I see, says the blind man to his deaf wife who is talking on the phone with a dog. And that's a first for me. I've, I've at least said it multiple times while in a party with you. Never heard you say it. I don't think you have. No, I say it a lot, actually. I've never heard it. <gasps> Neither have I. Shadow, I can, I can 100% confirm that I have memory of saying it while in a party with you. The only explanation is that you didn't pay attention, or you didn't think I was the one saying it. So you paid it no mind. Probably the former. No, with you two, not surprising. Hey, at least I'm honest about it. <laughs> I still absolutely love how Euclid's response was it was the Mr. Ed thing all over again. Yeah, you remember that shit because you're laughing. A horse is a horse, of course, of course, and no one can talk to a horse, of course, unless, of course, that horse is the famous Mr. Ed. I still love how that broke my mental capacity for a good, like, five minutes. Okay, so, for anybody who's curious... I don't see how it does. Yeah, for anybody who's curious, my dad, re like, a while back, like, about, I want to say roughly halfway through last year, he introduced me to this thing, apparently it's a, it was an old television show called Mr. Ed, the Talking Horse. And it was literally a show, an old show, this is a show in black and white too, this is, this is an old show. It was a show about this horse that could talk called Mr. Ed and they'd ask it various questions. And that is basically the, op the first bit uh, half of the opening theme of the opening song to the show and I I said it once out of nowhere when I was in a party with Euclid and for the for legit like five minutes his brain shut the fuck down and he, I couldn't get anything out of him like you had to, his brain attempted to process it for that long need to reboot Pretty much. And then, like, after all this time, finally all I hear is Euclid.exe has stopped working. I'm just like, was it that bad? And he's like, what came out of your mouth? I'm like, Mr. Ed.
I have remembered what I'm doing. <laughs> Did you know? Was it anything good? Yes and no, and I just fucked up. I think I picked something up too soon. You know, that's par for the course with you. Um... What? Okay, I'm gonna record that, because... I don't know if what I saw is what I saw, and if it's what I did think I saw, what the actual hell happened to my game? Oh god. They're fucking me in the ass. Guys, they're fucking me in the ass! I was about to say <laughs> something, but uh... I uh, think I'll pull love, how I, love how I say the weirdest shit and <laughs> that gets silence. I was about to say you can stop bending over. Yeah, unfortunately I'm not. They just keep running up on me. Mm. They touched the butt. So, yeah, no, I'm, I'm just doing some zon solo zombie runs right now on, on Black Ops and... I shit- I was out in the pond, right? And I shit you not, I turned, and I- I'm pretty sure I saw a zombie walk out of a rock. Come on. Okay. Mm-hmm. Like that- like that come up, like, next to it from under the ground, like, it actually clipped out of the rock. Yeah, it makes sense to me. Really? Jesus. I've never remembered who the fuck I keep talking to. These are the people I associate with, folks. Help me, please. Save me. Oh, wait, there never mind. No help. Can't, I, can't, I can't request that one. There's, there's, no, there's no saving me. I'm already damned for, hell, for eternity in hell. I don't give a shit anymore. There is no stopping our influence. I'm pretty sure- I'm pretty sure my raging fucking hatred of all things society and human... I'm pretty sure that already damned me, so... So there's the... Hook shot! Hook no one's out in this bitch! What? Is a hook shot in there? Yep. The fuck? You occasionally have to use it in a few areas. Okay. I've officially not heard of everything. It's basically just a grappling hook, but it's called hook shot. Well. Oh, there's some, there's some copyright for you right there, guys. Nintendo's gonna be suing the ass off of, uh, off of Capcom eventually. I mean, they can't do it anymore since, you sure. know, they, they are working with them, you know, what you call it. A lot of things before. Oh yeah, Smash there you Bros. go. Left it up on the screen for a minute so you guys could see that there. Mm hmm Did this go? To hell? Yeah, that wasn't a funny joke, I know. Lame. Fuck off. I feel like at this point I should just grab a bottle of whiskey and chug it. Please don't. Why? So I want you fucking come here and... I mean... I will be, I'm just drinking the pain away. 
It ain't like he's the one playing the game. <laughs> That's also true, too. Really, there's no penalty right now for me drinking. Well, other than, you know, the normal ones. Or rather, you know, as normal as we get. At least in my case. Ow, stop touching me, you prick! I am trying to go to Coffin to leave me alone. And now you're dead. Because, you know, Coffin kills everything. For whatever reason. Coffin cannot be beat. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gonna have another shot. What's that thing yes. women? What's that thing women used to wear around their around their wrists, like way back? Massage? No, 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 no. Uh, like way back when, it was like that big furry thing. Muff! Furry thing. Muff! That's what it was. A muff. Hmm. You, they, it, it, muff cabbage! Like, they, you'd, it'd be like, it'd be like something that you put your hands in both ends. And it was like to keep, like, it was basically kind of like a, like a, like a high class type thing. Hmm. Muff cabbage. It was also used by women during, you know, the days of the West to, you know, conceal a Derringer pistol. You see this tiny glove? It has a fucking gun in it. Well, no, it's not a glove. It's... Think it, like it, a think like a Chinese you, you, finger torture trap, but it's for your wrists. And yes, I know what you're talking about. Shut the fuck up. I just took another shot, goddammit. Shut the fuck up. Shot, 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 shot. Don't do I run? I think I run as well. You know, Euclid, every time you say anything going against it, you realize you're the one who's encouraging it more, right? This reverse psychology, bitch. <laughs> no, it's more of when people genuinely tell me to not do things. It usually makes me really just want to do them. Get oh the yeah, flamer, baby! Brother. Yes! The heavy flamer. I don't care that I'm dying from gas! Eat dicks! All of you! Okay, that was weird. A lot of things are weird. I just had a hellhound slowly walking up the stairs. <coughs> I'm just creeping on in. Pretty much. It's literally just like fucking slow trotting up like yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna just, I'm just gonna stroll out up here. Look at my fucking swag, bitch. Oh happy day! I I'll see skies of blue. I can do it in the Nava voice, but it's been a while since I've actually listened to the music, so yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, the game's gonna auto save. I'm gonna open this door. Oh wait. No. Yay. I run away. Why? Because I don't give fucks. Yeah, I need to pack this motherfucker. I also need the fucking coal attachments. I need more ammo. I need a balloon gun. Ryan, seven, 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 bitches. Your arguments are goddamn bothered. Man, this is some intense gameplay going on right here. <laughs> yes, intense is the word to use. Shadows gameplay. Meanwhile, I'm over here fucking headbangers. Oh, no. Where is it? There it is. Brotherhood of Steel Recruit. Yes. Because I'm a filthy <laughs> brotherhood of steel symp yeah, sympathizer. I still love that the Duradada names are actual names in fucking um, Fallout 4. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Who, who, what now? Uh, characters from Duradada. Celte Sterlison, uh, Isaiah Orihara, you actually use their names, uh, what, what's his face will actually call you by their names. Interesting. So who's what's his face? <sighs> what's the robot? Uh, Codsworth? Codsworth, yeah. Oh shit! I know what you're I talking about. I even came down it took me a minute to idiot. fucking remember what you were talking about. Um. <clears throat> okay, that was a thing. He can also call you fuckface if you name yourself that. That is a, actually adorable. There's an actual Delta list team, out there. It's pretty we fucked up names. Over. Uh, I imagine so. This does not make any sense. Do 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 How do do was the do. <sighs> And why did it contaminate both the lab and the mansion, as well as the train almost three miles away? That is irrelevant. We must make sure no knowledge of this gets out. Destroy Fuck your spaz, I got a pump! Completely. How far away are you from the nearest branch line? Yeah, I fucking went there. What happened? Oh man, it's fine. Oh fuck. Death oh fuck. By leech. I forgot. I forgot how hard this fucking mod is. I legitimately, for a split second, Shadow, I thought you said death by bleach. Once again, folks, we do not condone suicide. <clears throat> <laughs> fucking. So I don't think I've ever told y'all how I made this fucking game hard. Um, that entirely depends. I'm pretty sure you told me and I kinda tuned it out. Probably. The train but basically really I turn crash. on fucking... I gotta stop what's it, the zombie walker mod. Yeah. And uh... The... You wanna make the game hard, just play survival. This is oh, a no, different kind part, of but... hard. I'll go over to the back deck and manipulate the control panel for the brake. Then you apply the brake from I here. Okay. Okay. Just All right. Laser rifle. Fuck yeah. Billy. What? Be I'd rather have a rifle yeah. over a pistol right now. Holy 
Holy shit, they don't stop. Fucking headshots. Eh, I might get crushed. Nah. The only bad thing about Fallout 4 is it fucking crashes like crazy. Yeah, yeah. Not for me, it didn't. Well, mine does because obvious reasons, but mm -hmm. when it works, it's fun. Well, excuse me that the game's automatically resurrecting every dead NPC to add to the enemy count. Mm -hmm. Unless they're killed with a headshot. Or double tapped. Or, you know, you just remove the fucking head. That's an option. Decapitation! Why do you think I- why do you think I purposely in, in, uh, I purposely get, like, a high-powered sniper up on mine? Why do you think I do that? It's literally so I can just bats everything. And just blow everything's head clean off. Okay, I know I put brain around on the shotgun, but it's not actually doing its fucking job. It's <laughs> not a chance. It's yeah, but with a packed shotgun, I'll at least brain rot every other enemy I've shot. This isn't brain rotted a fucking thing. It's killing them too fucking fast. I'll consider that. Whatever your fucking name was, I forgot. Mr. Eye Patch Person thing. I'll let you know when I actually give a shit, though. I don't really care to extract. Extract me is for the pussies. Extract is for pussies. You know? People with no balls. I'm pretty sure they. I'm pretty. I'm, I'm starting to think they might have tweaked brain rot. It is brain rot that I find. Yeah, it is brain rot. Then what the fuck? Does it just not trigger with a shotgun anymore? All right, folks. What you just saw is. uh Limits of stupidity right there. What did you do? Ran around in a fucking circle. I, I mean, it's, uh, it's Resident Evil. I'm pretty sure that's a, that's a normal thing. Okay, let me go ahead and fucking mess with this mod before my game crashes again. Resident Evil. Oh, <laughs> I love how he says that. And I'm literally sitting here thinking, and it will crash right after he said this. I swear to God, if I update this, no loot enabled. Da, 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 da. Infection settings, resurrect NPC. Sure. Oh, Extra right. spawns, area spawn limit 50 zombies, max 25. Not gonna lie, when I heard extra before you said spawn, and I heard only the S sound, I thought you were about to say extra spicy. And for some reason, I'm not sure why I thought you were gonna say that, but I did. Extra spicy, man. Gotta get that KFC uh, famous bowl, spicy famous bowl. There! For I finally fucking brain ride one! Holy sh- Oh, I need a crawler. If anyone ever finds this that knows me and knows what I'm making a joke about... <laughs> he says if anyone ever finds this, like, we're- like, we're leaving a fucking one of those time capsules. <laughs> I don't know if, if I ever get asked about this, I'm totally gonna tell people <laughs> fucking stupid shit. 
But you know I'm what I sure, mean. I'm pretty sure if any of us was anywhere and somebody actually recognized us for some re somehow from this, I'm pretty sure if they asked us any question, we'd all eagerly answer it. Yeah, more or less. Unless it was like super, super, super personal. Or, you know, like our deepest, darkest secrets. Wait, does anybody does anybody here even have one of those? I'm having a hard time hearing anything because of the video game music, so one more time. Does do, do any of us even have like a deepest, darkest secret? I'll go over to the back deck and Technicality I do. But like Something you like, genuine, really okay. like right. it has to be something you at that you absolutely will never tell anybody, and that you feel absolutely nobody should ever learn about you. <sighs> no, I don't think I do. Okay, so I'm not the only one that doesn't have one of those. Oh, hi, you're here. Okay, legitimately, that is one of the strangest names for a video game character ever because I legitimately thought you meant Paladin Dance. Like, not dances in his name, like dances in his name. Yeah. Like, that's exactly, that's like literally what my first thought was when I heard that. I'm like, what the fuck's a Paladin Dance? And then you started saying, I don't need you, and I'm like, oh. So my game didn't immediately crash, so I'm pretty sure it was the zombies. Really? You think? You think? <laughs> if you read the fucking mod, it tells you best use when starting a new game. <sighs> yeah, he has a problem. Well, in this case, not really. In this case, it's more Euclid decides to keep trying to push the boundaries of his fucking console's processing power. With very, very negative results in most of the time. I do dumb thing, console almost go boom. Yeah, no shit, sure. No shit, it was a dumb thing. Sometimes, sometimes I genuinely believe that if the three of us actually, like, got together, like, to live somewhere together, I feel like Billy, at some, I feel like it wouldn't take very long for either A, Roger, for us right to somehow light the fucking house on fire, or B, drive each other to actually attempt to kill ourselves, or each other. Now, now, I I will say I'm not absolutely fucking insane. You go, you associate with me in shadow. You have to be insane. Associating with me in shadow, being insane is almost a fucking requirement. 
Or, you know, a fucking sociopath. No, I don't have my tape recorder, so shut up. Yeah, that's an actually a good question. Did anybody own a tape recorder in this day and age? Let's actually ask that. I, uh, I, I. Do you have a phone? I mean, a tape recorder for like a tape, not a fucking a audio. Eight track. Not eight track, just a cassette. Where you know what I mean? The one, the one we're thinking about. So, not, not a track. Actually, I don't no. even think they had recorders for eight tracks back then. I don't currently own one anymore. Anymore? So you did have one? Yeah. Really? I've wow. Had a few. I've never had one. I had one a very long time ago. I've never had one. Mm, I've had an special. MP. I've had an MP3 player that could record Rebecca. audio through Rebecca. a very, very, very small I, microphone yeah. that it had in it. Are you all right? Hey. I've had this audio recorders true. and yes. video recorders. We, we have to find a way out. Sorry, you started doing that, and I was thinking. Of, I started thinking of criminal flaws again. I have so much of his shit on my iPhone. I've still got to make. I still got to make the final one. Fucking my ringtone. I can only remember how to do that. Now I can exchange it for there. It's a kill up in this bitch. Right. Now I give them all the suck. No, 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 sell, sell. What did I say? I will give Sun Goku the suck if it's the last thing I do. Sell, sell, sell. Do I need to put you back in the corner? You can't put me in the corner. Only I put me in the corner. And put yourself in the corner, buddy, because Never! You can't. <sighs> <sighs> One of these is my Just controls. Try yeah. and do it. It's kind of sad we've reached the end of the stream and now you're doing that shit. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> If you were watching the stream, you would see I just reached a mansion. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm busy dealing with my own zombie apocalypse, so I can't deal with yours at the moment. That I'm dealing with me? Nah, I'm not dealing with that. Yeah, no, so that So who's watching the stream? Uh, yeah, that's a good question, actually. It's not me. <laughs> I got a viewer, but it doesn't count me because I'm in the stream manager. So uh, someone's actually uh, watching. If we had somebody watching us this entire time, I guess. Yep, apparently so. I mean, is it really that surprising? What the fuck was that? Wait, where did you come from? I mean, someone's like the slightly. research center. I find it a little surprising. 
Usually no one really comes around when we're doing... Dumb shit. Old games. I was about to say, if you say Resident Evil, I was about to say, motherfucker, this is like second First stream. general manager, Dr. James Marcus. Who on earth are those people? She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm, what about the male? I'm unfamiliar with Attention. him. Attention! So, this is Dr. to the Marcus. now two Please people... Well, one of them is me. I was, I was checking. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. Oh, oh, oh. To the other person who is unity. viewing this. Unity breeds power. Power Sorry. Go back power. and watch the first episode. <laughs> who are you? It was I who scattered the virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train to what? Revenge on Umbrella. Subscribe, like. I'll just, I, you know, we used to have a Facebook, but no one actually used it. So, go subscribe I'm to sorry. Facebook. I <laughs> don't go on Facebook all that much because it lags like a motherfucker. I just don't use Facebook, man. What's a Facebook? Follow us here I don't, on I don't Twitch. I recall us having a Facebook for the channel. We had a tw we have a Twitter, and I still Dr. have that. I just no, we it. have a Facebook. You helped. I went. We actually have a Facebook page since the beginning. <laughs> I don't remember this. <laughs> See, that's how much we used it. Oh wait, now I remember. <laughs> I do have a fucking login shit for that <laughs> saved on that note on my phone <laughs> with the logins for everything else. See, I wasn't lying. Yeah, I just remembered it. Don't get excited, motherfucker. Switching characters. Alright, grab that motherfucking ink ribbon so we can save this shit. <laughs> Even though I already have ink ribbons. Okay. Oof, we're ending the stream off on a bad foot. Did you already break the game? Did you already die? Well, technically I did die because I had to reset. Because I ran around in a fucking circle and I might not have had enough time to enter the codes and it would have counted as death anyways. So I reloaded. But, um, no. Both of our people are in caution. They're hurting. And uh, you're, supposed, you're supposed to be, like, a some... pro at this shit. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't say pro. Not at the, um, older ones. I mean, let me rephrase that. If I was on the original consoles for them, and it was still back when I was playing them religiously, yes. I haven't played this one specifically to its completion since it... I want to say around the time when it first came out. I think, I'm not sure. I had a dog hey, clipped into the tank in the pond. When did Resident Evil Zero get released? Uh, probably around like 19... 2002. Uh, 2002. Yeah, cause it didn't come- that didn't come out until like after the second one did. Mm-hmm. So, back around 2002 is the last time I played this game to its completion. So I do not remember it nowhere near as well as I do the other games. Mm -hmm. Did the stream already end, or are we just literally sitting here talking? Well, we're actually about to end the stream right now, so go ahead and do your thing. Motherfucker, I hate you so much. Why have me type in outro for you if you're not going to make me do the fucking outro? I hate you so much. I only did that because, well, I'm only doing it now because of your reaction. Good. Ass. But there are going to be days when you're not going to be doing the stream with me, and I'm still streaming. Really? Because at this point, it seems like... I almost streamed last night, but I got fucking acid. 
Right, that that's that that's the excuse we're going with. Yes, that's the excuse. Anyway, so Do the goddamn outro. Fuck off. That's gonna be it for tonight, everybody. Hope you've all enjoyed. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and smash the like button down below. Sports always very greatly appreciated. If you want to catch our streams live, you can go ahead and follow us here on Twitch at Shadow Weavers PCG. And if you want to catch any of our streams afterward, you can go ahead and subscribe to us over on our YouTube at Shadow Weavers Partially Censored Gaming. And Shadow, your turn, because you're the one fucking planning this bus ride. So, if you haven't noticed with the first two streams, I'm kind of doing this at a major checkpoint basis. Right now, this is about as far as I've gotten in my uh, review play to catch myself up on how to play and everything. So, I don't remember how long it takes to run through everything else anymore. So that's going to be fun, guys. Uh, the next stream will be... I think I might do this every other day or so. Oh. Not 100% sure. So far, it's been a whenever I feel like running the stream. Oh, me and you we play, I'm, me and will you have tomorrow, a stream right? coming. Yep. We will have a stream coming at you tomorrow. <sighs> I don't know what game we're going to play. It's probably going to be Call of Duty, but we are going to test something out here maybe tonight or sometime tomorrow for another game for you guys to watch us play. Oh, fuck But for yes. now, if you enjoyed what you saw, do what he said. Go to YouTube. Go to the fucking Twitch if you're watching this on YouTube. Do the shit. Help us out. It's greatly appreciated. Enjoy your day, and talk to you next time. Mm -hmm. Bye. Later.